This is Mayor Dorian Lord. I need an ambulance at the Buchanan Mansion. Clint Buchanan has had a heart attack. And I suggest that you hurry. They're on their way. Oh. Unless, of course, they get held up in traffic. It's okay. It's okay. Dad, Dad, can you hear me? He's been unresponsive the last few minutes. You killed him. Of course he can't respond. No, no, he's still alive. He's got a pulse. You knocked that off. I, the I tried to here. save him. I, I gave him an aspirin. I called for that ambulance. Dad, did you hear? Did you hear that, Dad? The paramedics are here. Okay, you're gonna be all right. You're gonna be okay. I'm gonna stay here. I'm gonna stay right here with you. Aubrey, can you can you get me some clothes? Yeah, I'll get mine too. No, 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 no. You stay here. Uh, 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 there's not enough space in the ambulance for everyone. Besides, I'm a medical doctor. They're going to need me. They're gonna be here any second. All right, oh, Dad. Oh, you could call Kevin and tell him what happened. He'll know who to call. I'm right here with you, all right, Dad? Just hold on, please, hold on. Any word yet, Joe? No, not yet. They got him here quickly. That's good. Yeah, that's what the EMT said. Every minute counts. Dad is alive because of you. Oh, I wouldn't say that. No, it's true. I was in the right place at the right time. Thank God. I mean, if, if you hadn't come over and found him when you... Why did you come over? Rama said you you stopped by. Did you forget something? No, I don't, no, I don't know. know. I don't know what I would do if he made a 180 like that. I don't know. And good for me that I'm not going to have to know that because he's not going to do it. Get it? Oh, ye of little faith. Okay, she's not going to tell Joe about Cutter and Aubrey. Someone else will. Yes, I did forget something. I came to the house to see you. Why? There's something I have to tell you about your wife. You want to talk to me about Aubrey? <gasps> yes. Oh, Joe, oh, how is he? Oh, they still don't know. Dr. Shen's working on him. Where's Vicky? She's at home with Liam. I'm supposed to call her as soon as I know something. It's the doctor. How's Dad? Yeah, is, is he gonna be all right? disease, but it does not excuse what he did. I'm so sorry. I just can't think about that now. No, of course you can't. You must be worried sick. I've just come from the hospital. I was the one who found him. Clint. Oh, it's just tell me. How are you holding up? I could be better. Yes, of course. Vicky, I've got a confession to make. I knew about Charlie and Echo all along. What? Charlie promised me he would end it. And I believed him. I thought perhaps you'd never need to know. Oh. So I guess you're not very good at this friend thing, are you? I wanted to spare you. I did not know how much more you could take. Oh, what did you think? That I was going to break into little pieces, bring one of my altars out? Oh, it would have been too much for any one of us. Well, not for me. 
not so weak that an echo de Savoy can break me down. No, you are not. And now, thanks to me, you got the power to destroy her. Joey. They're going to be taking you upstairs for some tests in a little bit, so... Uh... Dad? Dad, if you can hear me, can you please just squeeze my hand? Please? Hey. Hey. How is he? Oh. I'm not going to know for a little while, so... Uh... Okay, well, I called Kevin. He'll call the rest of the family. He asked for an update as soon as you have it. Thank if you, you want, I can make those calls. Thank you. Bobby, I'm really glad you're here. I don't know how I would have been able to do this without you. Well, you don't have to, okay? I'm here. <laughs> I'm right here. <laughs> Troubling. Troubling? Hmm. It's a gift wrap confession. And Clint just gave you this? He wasn't in a position to negotiate. <laughs> but the meaning is very, very clear. It's obvious. Echo knew all along that Rex wasn't Charlie's son. And now you've got the power to blow that bitch out of the water if you want to, mm. thanks to me. Oh, that's true. Is that all you're going to say? What else did you want? I thought you'd be more grateful. Grateful? Oh, my goodness, yes. I'm very, very grateful. The thing is, that I just, I, I can't bear to think about Charlie and Echo right now. You know, with Clint in the hospital hanging between life and death. And but he's the father of my children, you know? And they are so distraught. But you shouldn't let this go on for too long. No, I won't. I won't. In fact, I'm going to let you know before I do anything. Good night, Dorian. Good night. listening. 